how did you get started into acting? Oh, the long, the, the short story of it, I, I never intended on doing this. Really? If somebody had told me I would have been here at this time 40 some odd years ago, whatever it was, I would have told them they were crazy. I was trained to be an artist. I wanted to be a cartoonist and an illustrator. And uh, wow. as fate would have it, as it, it often does, uh, I happened to be, a, it was my senior year in college. There was a gentleman there who was working on his doctorate in directing, and he was directing a play. And he was minus one actor. He couldn't find anybody to do it. And we happened to be in the same place at the same time, had a mutual friend. He was telling her his dilemma. He happened to peruse across the student union. There may have been 500 people in mm. at lunchtime. And she said, why don't you ask Jim? He came over, introduced himself, told me what he was doing. I was very reticent. You know, nobody in my family had ever been involved in the creative arts anyway. But he was very convincing. And uh, he said, can, I, I think you could do this. I mean, it's a, a nice play. It's only for a weekend in college. You know, those runs are usually just a weekend. So uh, I'll never forget the play. It was called Matters of Choice. So I said, OK. And I did it, and uh, I got the bug, and uh, as they say, uh, the rest is <laughs> the history. The rest is history. Yeah. Talk well. about getting the bug. That is amazing. I mean, that means it was destined. It was meant to yeah. be, would you yeah. say? Yeah, I, 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 I had no say in it after that. Yeah, oh but it's, it's, been, it's been a blast. And speaking of mutual friends, I heard that back in New York, you were in a play with Samuel Jackson and Denzel Washington. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. What was that yeah. like? Do y'all see this picture? Oh, yeah, there it is. Yeah, wow. That's a long time ago. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, uh, actually, I got my equity card from this show with the uh, prestigious Negro Ensemble Company. It was a soldier's play. It went on to win just about every critical award there was. It won the Pulitzer Prize for theater that year, and we were just getting started, myself, Sam, Denzel, and uh, it kind of helped to kind of launch our careers from there, and uh, it was one of the high points of my life. So y'all were legends starting out. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> yeah, it was a lot of fun. Uh, that is really fascinating to me. Well, that is awesome to see. You. Are you guys still close? Still close, yeah. They're probably two of my dearest friends, our kids, almost literally grew up together. And, and we, we talk when we can, and we can kind of stay in touch and see how everybody's doing. But yeah, they're, they're, they're dear friends of mine. They're, you know, ride or die cats. Yeah, Man, sure. I can't help but to wonder, who better to ask? So you know how you start out when you're young and everybody have a vision of what they're going to do? Did all y'all discuss back then, like, I'm going to do this and I'm going to do that because you're all legends? Well, uh, I think we were just glad to have a job, you know, <laughs> uh, especially back then doing theater and stuff. And you, you have dreams and aspirations, yeah. obviously. I don't think we really talked about them that much. I mean, we were so focused on doing the work and, and hopefully perpetuating the careers as they went along. So, and, and every once in a while, you know, I may talk to Sam and, and uh, say, man, you know, do you think this would happen like this? And, you know, we kind of say, well, yeah. <laughs> <You know? laughs> but yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's been a heck of a ride. Amazing icons. Oh, my goodness. And you're celebrating your 40th anniversary with your wife. Celebrating my 40th wedding anniversary, May 27th. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. How did you guys meet? How did we meet? I met her in New York, but she was from my hometown. I'm originally from Cleveland. She was from Cleveland, but I didn't know her there. Really? So I go to New York to meet a Cleveland girl. <laughs> and uh, she, was, she was in the business as well. Uh, she was actually was a, a singer, and she was on Broadway. She did Dream Girls and Beehive and Lead of the Pack. And she was part of the whole disco era thing. She was with a group called Music that had a big hit back in the late 70s called Push, Push in the Bush. Mm. <laughs> Y'all know that one. Yeah, that, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> and so, uh, yeah, and uh, you know, here we are uh, 40, years, 40 years later. I, I didn't think anybody could be with me for 40 minutes. <laughs> 40 years, but it's been a heck of a ride. So. Beautiful. Thank Congratulations you. to you that. Much. That is Appreciate awesome. You. You got the key. Because <laughs> it's, was it 20 years into Grey's Anatomy? 20 seasons. This will be 20 seasons. 20 seasons. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Thank oh, you. my God. What is the new season like? What is it about? Oh, uh, well, you know, we got to keep Ziploc bags uh -huh. on that. But we thought we'd uh, try. What I can tell you is that we, we, we would leave, we come back to where we left off during at, at season 19, right before 
all the strike craziness and right. everything happened. But we'll, we'll hit the ground running. I think the audiences are going to be very excited with what they see. We got a new crop of interns who I'm really excited about, really talented young ac actors and stuff. And I think they will keep that momentum and, and that storytelling alive. It's going to be a lot of fun. We can't wait yeah. to see, that's thank for you. sure. Thank you, thank you. Oh my goodness. And then you had a mini Grey's Anatomy reunion at the Emmys. Oh yeah, we had one and uh, myself and Ellen Pompeo and Sandra mm -hmm. Wilson and they, they got Katie Heigl back and Justin Chambers. And it was like a mini reunion. We had a blast. We presented in the category for Best Supporting Actor in an anthology or a movie. And it was a lot of fun being with them again, yeah, mm. for sure. That's amazing. If you like this video, smash that like button and subscribe to the Jennifer Hudson Show YouTube channel. Check your local listings or visit JenniferHudsonShow.com to see when you can watch full episodes in your area. And don't forget to sign up for the newsletter.